And the Nigerian police force has tasked about 40 new commissioners of police to be law-abiding and respect the extant laws of the land. The Inspector General of Police, Mohammed Adamu, while reading the riot act to the newly promoted commissioners of police in Abuja, as he met with commanders of tactical and operational units of the force, warned that they will be held accountable for their actions and they perform their duties to the nation. Organization can advance beyond the competence and dedication of its strategic leaders. Neither can any organizational goals and plans be attained without a crop of highly committed personnel to drive the implementation process. The rapidly changing dynamics of crime and the attendant increasing threat to security requires quality police managers that have the requisite professional knowledge, experience, and competency to effectively provide leadership directed at managing such internal security threats. The impact of this is that any organization that does not, for delays in recognizing the potentials of its personnel and rewarding them by promoting those eligible as at when due, stands the risk of returning crops of highly demotivated officers who will not be optimally dedicated to the standards and goals of the institutions. I'm confident that you will deploy your wealth of experience towards supporting the Nigeria police in the attainment of our mandate, especially at this critical time in our nation's internal security evolution. Let me, however, remind the promoters that to whom much is given, much is expected. Crime, as you know, is a dynamic and increasingly complex phenomenon and the nation demands of your high level of loyalty, courage, and professional competence needed to move the Nigeria police and indeed the nation to the next level in relation to internal security.